please stand for a moment of silence, followed by the pledge. And now the pledge. I, I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Welcome back to this November 6th edition of the Daily Growl. I'm Daryl. And I'm Layla. Happy Nachos Day. Olé! After, after school, head over to America's favorite Mexican restaurant and get yourself some nachos. Or save that money so you can get some nachos and fried Oreos at the game tonight. Go Wildcats! On this day in history in 1968, Richard Nixon won the, a close contest for a president over Mr. Humphrey and became the 37th president of the United States. If you don't vote, you don't have an opinion on this. Way to show up and vote this past Tuesday. And now it's time for yesterday's news today. In De Denia Beach, Florida, authorities say that a 10-foot Burmese python was removed from under the hood of a car in Florida. The Florida Fish and Wildlife Conservation Commission said that in a said in a tweet Thursday that the snake was coiled up inside the engine compartment of a Ford Mustang in Denia Beach, which is adjacent to our Ford Lauderdale. Our officers responded and safely captured and removed the approximately 10-foot invasive snake. I'm sure that wasn't covered on the insurance quote. Speaking of snakes on a plane, the weather today will be a sunny with a high of 79 and a low of 68 and a 40% chance of rain. Rain isn't expected until late Friday night. We'd like to wish a happy birthday today to Autumn Hans and Javen Thomas. We really hope you guys have a wonderful birthday today. It's I'd also- like to wish a happy birthday today to Autumn Hans and Javen Thomas. And Miss Cushenberry. Do you ever ask yourself, I don't know what's going on? You can watch the news and be informed by clicking on the link in our bio on, in, on Instagram at Daily Girl TV. It's that easy. Or you can visit the high school website under For Students tab to see the news on the daily. Mu Alpha Theta will be inducting 52 new members on Monday, November 9th at 6.30 in BCHS Auditorium. Family members are welcome and veteran members of Mu Alpha Theta are also invited. Refreshments will be served afterwards, so be sure to get there. <coughs> Any seniors who need assistance filling out their FAFSA, we will be hosting FAFSA night, FAFSA night on Monday, November 9th, and Monday, November 16th from 4 to 6 p.m. in the BCHS library. Spaces are limited due to social distancing, and you will need to sign up in your English class to reserve a spot. 10th grade class t-shirts are now on sale. See Mrs. Hughes or Mrs. Johnson for an order form, or print one from Google Classroom. We'll be accepting cash only with a completed order form until Friday, November 6, 2020 at 2.35 p.m. Get You're done. done. Check out bakerk12.org slash bchs and click on the calendar to keep up with all that's going on and find out lots of other information on our website as well. It's another Football Friday, Wildcats, but new seasons are upon us. This week, look forward to soccer, girls weightlifting, and coming soon, Wildcat basketball. Follow us on Facebook, Twitter, or Instagram to stay in the know. This week's seasons wrap up with Swimcat Regionals. Good luck, guys. The girls weightlifting will hold a mock meet and to get the party started. Also, tonight, Wildcat Football will host Swanee, and it's senior night. Don't miss it. Want to win a breakfast? I sure do. The annual food drive runs through November 19th. You can help families in our own community, and the first period class with the most points wins a free breakfast party. Who wouldn't want that? We need, a can, we need canned food, box food, turkeys, and hams. Don't wait until the end. Start today. The PERT test will be given on November 10th. You must sign up and guidance today. Don't miss it. That's it for today, Wildcats. We hope you have a football senior night Friday. We'll, we'll see, see you tomorrow. tomorrow.